In this video, I'll show you how to enable the swipe left to read news and articles. If this is what you want to have, my phone, I have it disabled. This is called the Google Discover feature. You can actually swipe left to see the whole Google app only from here like a shortcut. And inside the Google app, you choose to see the news articles or not, which is called Google Discover. So let's see. On your phone, this might be a little bit different, but usually the settings are very similar. So what you have to do is long press somewhere on an empty area of your home screen, long press, and then you will get a menu like this. On my phone, I see the menu like this, but for your phone it might be different. What you want to search for is home settings or settings in general. So here I have home settings. On my phone here, I have the option to disable the search bar and disable the Google's. On the home settings here, I have the option to show Google app, show quick search box. I have them disabled, both of them. Uh, the search box is a long story, maybe another video. I think I made one before. It might be useful. I like to use this. And also there is the Google's, there is the show Google app when you swipe right from the main home screen. So swipe right, enable this option. For you, it might be somewhere different in another place. And now, when I swipe right like this, I say swipe left, but actually when you swipe, you go from left to right. So to open something from the left. And here I have the Google search. And there is a lot of this uh, predefined searches, popular searches right now. You can make a Google search, you can make voice commands here. I don't know why the Google Lens is not showing there. It's a long story with the search bar. I don't have it. I don't have it. I wish I could use it, but it doesn't work for me after updates. And now I can turn on Discover from here. It's really easy. If you don't have Discover enabled, the articles here, you can just with one press, you can turn it on. But I will show you another way to do it from the Google app directly search for Google. You have to install the Google app from the Play Store. So from Google LLC, the Google app, I open the Google app. And now if you see here on the top, there is the Google icon, the Google logo, and I can also turn it on from here. But you can actually use the settings of this app. You can press here on your picture. After you open this menu, you have options to, to for search history to save, save search tasks, lots of options here, but what you're looking for is settings. Once you open the settings page, you get all this customization for the Google Assistant. If you enable the voice match and Hey Google, and you can use Gemini voice commands, lots of things here. Other settings is what you look for. And in other settings, you can enable discover. That's all enable discover from here, but you could have done it. Yeah, so now you get all these articles. Mostly, mostly clickbait articles here. And also the same thing you get here on this side. So I'm trying to swipe through them pretty fast. So I don't get any. I'm, I'm trying to swipe through them pretty fast so I don't get any copyright strikes because of a picture. But most of the times these articles, they are clickbait articles and mostly from websites that are very big and they know how to make you read something without really telling you anything. <laughs> so it's up to you. You have the option now. Now you have this discover. And if you want to turn it off, you can if you want to turn it off, you have to go to the same page and actually you can go to the same page from here directly. If you want to turn it off, you can go to the same page from your profile picture here, the same as you did before. And now it doesn't show you to disable it here. There is nothing. You can just see more stories. Very bad. <laughs> Let's see. But. Uh, Clickbait. Oh, they have a nice feedback option to report clickbait. Not sure if this was really clickbait, but most of this is clickbait. I don't I don't like it. I 
hide it. You can hide some. I think actually there would be an algorithm here where you could actually, if you hide items, articles you don't want to see, and if they give you the feedback and you you are truthful about what you see here, um, I think you can create your list here, turn on discovery, actually, you might be able to actually make it make it better that you see things that you are interested in. That, that would be interesting. I might actually try to keep this on and see if I can get it to something that I might want to read at some point. Anything about sports, Daily Express, Marta's to the Guardian, I don't know, The Guardian, Bright Cyprus Mail, this is okay, not bad. Let's see this one. Yeah, so scientists discovered the formation of Earth sixth ocean. I bet this is some whatever. Maybe it's true. I have no idea. Yeah, so this is the Google Discover. Maybe if you you spend some time to hide the articles you don't like and read the ones you like, maybe it will show you things that are more relevant to you relevant relevant so that would be worth trying i would try to keep it on you can always disable it from the same menu here so you go in this menu here and you go into the settings in settings you can go to other settings and just with one tap just like that with one tap the google discover is gone but you can turn it on from this button so it's pretty simple now I think it's showing me different things. I don't know. About cars. And not, not too bad. Yeah, they give this uh, option. I don't know about this. Uh, I never like these online diets. 2121. That's it. Thanks for watching. You can always re-enable it. It's harder to disable it than to enable it. When it's disabled, it's one tap and you enable it. When you want to disable it, it's more complicated. Thanks for watching.